students my name is Angel Ravindra Bhalera I am studying in Podar International School in class 7 today my subject is science and topic is wastewater system so let's start wastewater system wastewater is used water from any combination of domestic industrial commercial or agricultural activities surface runoff or storm water and any sewer inflow or sewer infiltration after treatment at a wastewater treatment plant treated wastewater also called as effluent is discharged to a sieving receiving water body wastewater or sewage the terms wastewater and sewage are regularly used in interchangeably however there are differences between both in fact sewage is considered a subset of wastewater although the term sewage usually brings toilets to mind it is used to describe all types of wastewater generated from domestic dwellings source of wastewater domestic wastewater hospital sewage industrial wastewater agricultural effluents source of wastewater wastewater comes from ordinary living process bathing toilet flushing laundry dish washing etc it comes from residential and domestic resources commercial wastewater comes from non domestic sources such as beauty salon furniture refinishing furniture refinishing musical instrument cleaning or auto body repair shops domestic wastewater it comes from toilets sinks showers washing machines and industrial process and was historically called sewage wastewater produced due to human activities in household is called domestic industrial wastewater wastewater from manufacturing or chemical processes in industries contributes to water pollution industrial wastewater usually contains specific and readily identifiable chemical compounds water pollution is concentrated within a few subsectors mainly in the form of toxic waste and organic pollutants agricultural waste water agricultural waste water is primarily the excess water that runs off the field at the low end of furrows border strips basins and flooded areas during surface irrigation these facilities generate considerable amounts of agricultural industrial waste water typically containing high concentration of organic matter composition of waste water waste water is a complex matrix containing significant concentrations of solids dissolved and particulate matter microorganisms nutrients heavy metals and micro pollutants sewage systems sewage system network of pipes pumps and force mains for the collection of waste water or sewage from a community modern sewage system fall under two categories domestic and industrial sewers and storm sewers waste water treatment waste water treatment is a process used to remove contaminants from the waste water or sewage and convert it into an effluent that can be returned to the water cycle with an acceptable impact on the environment or reused for various purposes primary treatment primary treatment removes material that will either float or readily settle out by gravity it includes the physical process of screening comminution grit removal and sedimentation secondary treatment secondary treatment is a treatment process for waste water or sewage to achieve a certain degree of effluent quality by using a sewage treatment plant with physical phase separation to remove settle able solids and a biological process to remove dissolved and suspended organic compounds aeration aeration involves perforating the soil with small holes to allow air water and nutrients to penetrate the grass roots this helps the roots grow deeply and produce a stronger 
more vigorous lawn. The main reason for aerating is to alleviate soil compaction. Secondary sedimentation tank. The secondary sedimentation tanks are circular tanks equipped with rotating mechanical sludge and scum collectors. Appurtenant systems include spray system for moving scum and for odor control. Tertiary treatment. Tertiary treatment is the final cleaning process that improves wastewater quality before it is reused, recycled or discharged to the environment. The treatment removes remaining inorganic compounds and substances such as the nitrogen. Tertiary treatment is the advanced treatment process following secondary treatment of wastewater that produce high quality water. Tertiary treatment includes removal of nutrients such as nitrogen and partially all suspended and organic matter from wastewater. Alternative methods of sewage disposal An alternate low cost method of sewage disposal is a septic tank. It consists of tank in which sewage is allowed to flow. Anaerobic bacteria in the tank decompose the sewage. Other methods are chemical toilets and composting pits. These are referred to as one site sewage disposal system. Septic tank. Septic tank. A septic tank is an underground chamber made of concrete fiberglass or plastic through which domestic wastewater flows for basic treatment, settling and anaerobic process reduce solids and organics, but the treatment efficiency is only moderate. Septic tanks system are a type of simple one-site sewage facility. Chemical toilet. A chemical toilet collects human excreta in a holding tank and uses chemicals to minimize odors. These toilets are usually but not always self-contained and movable. A chemical toilet is structured around a relatively small tank which needs to be emptied frequently. Thank you. So guys, I hope you like this video. If you like this video, please hit the like button, share with your friends and if you have any suggestions for me, please write in comment box. Bye. Have a good day.